in the previous video i have explained that the total cash flow statement is divided into three cash flow from operating activity cash flow from investing activity and cash flow from financing activity so the statement is also in this order first one operating investing then financing okay so first we will discuss cash flow from operating activity and when we prepare the cash flow from operating activity the concept that you have to make clear is in this we will show the inflow and outflow of cash from operating activities operating activity means the main business the main activity of the business okay if i, I am a furniture dealer the buying and selling of furniture is the main business and it is the operation of the business okay so in this activity we will record we will identify the inflows and outflows and we will find the net cash from operation okay and i will explain how to find the net cash from operation okay for that we will take one example suppose the sale of the business is 1 lakh and it is an operation activity operating activity then interest income interest income from investment activities that means we will receive interest when we invest somewhere okay that is 10000 so the total revenue of the business is 1 lakh 10000 1 lakh plus 10000 1 lakh 10000 and in that 1 lakh is operating activity then interest income is investing activity then then the expenses are given purchase 50000 purchase is an operating activity operating expense 20000 it is also an operating activity finance expense uh, 15000 finance expense will come under financing activity then depreciation it can be taken as operating activity okay so when we find the net profit of the business we will get 1 lakh 10000 minus 50000 20000 15000 and 5000 the net profit of the business we will get it as 20000 okay some may think that this is the remaining cash from the business no it may not be the same the net profit of the business and the cash from the operating activity will be different okay so we have to find the cash profit from operating activity okay so how we can find the cash profit from operating activity there are two methods first one we can take all the operating cash inflow and from that we have we can subtract operating cash outflow then we will get the net cash profit okay i will explain here the operating cash inflow is sale sale 1 lakh is an operating cash inflow interest is an investing activity so we should not take that then purchase is an operating cash outflow operating expenses operating cash outflow then finance expense is a financing outflow so we should not take and last one depreciation depreciation means fall in the value of assets actually it is an expense but we are not paying any cash as depreciation we are not paying any cash there is no cash outflow okay so when we find the cash profit it should not be deducted okay clear when we find net profit it will be deducted because it is an expense or loss but there is no cash outflow so when we find the cash profit it should not be deducted okay so it should not be taken so what is the remaining cash from operating activity 1 lakh minus 50000 minus 20000 that is 30000 and this is a cash profit this is the first method to find the cash profit cash profit from operating activity but in most of the time this method cannot be applied because 
the details of sale purchase or operating expense will not be given in the question the only thing that is that will be given in the question will be net profit only the net profit will be given in the question so from that we have to find cash profit how we should we can find the cash profit there is a format the format to find the cash profit from the operating activity from the net profit of the business okay that format i will explain now so the base to find the cash profit from the operating activity is the net profit before tax of the business okay so please the first we should write cash flow from operating activity and under that we should take the base net profit before tax so there are three columns first one to write the particulars second column for the workings and third column final amount 